Now here's Brian McCormick, the radio voice of the Henderson Silver Knights, and today is calling his second National Hockey League game. I just love hockey. I just love watching hockey games. So, hey, Brian, there's going to be two games. <sighs> and then you just had to one-up it? It's fun. Not only calling two games, but doing it in different states. Leaves it in the corner for Carlson. Back for a while, right face-off circle. Carlson takes over again, left circle. Marcheseau settles it down. Carrier at center is for Yanmark. Over the Anaheim line, cuts to the middle, back down low, tipped on goal, and a save made by Gibson on Carrier. For McNabb gave it to the half wall for Petrangelo. He's being swarmed. Got some help, though, from Nolan Patrick, and now Brooks can flip it to center. Amadio over the red line dumps it in. Shattenkirk will wait in the trapezoid. 90 seconds left in regulation time. Carrick through center, big hit in the neutral zone. Carrick laid out in front of the penalty boxes, and now everyone gets into it. Braden McNabb came across a thundering hit, and they're unable to get a handle on Braden McNabb, and he and Carrick squared off. McNabb, a couple of swings, now Carrick gets him down, and now the lines will pull him apart. And a heat-seeking missile thundering Carrick into the glass. Where they rise to their feet at T-Mobile Arena one last time in 2021. Two seconds in one, that'll do it. As the Vegas Golden Knights have won 10 of their last 12. We expect in a few moments to have Nicholas Wong. You got the scoring started. You guys did such a good job tonight against John Gibson. I was pretty pumped to, to get one for, for the guys there and uh, to, get, to get us going on, on the board there. That is Nicholas Waugh, the goal scorer today. Nicholas Waugh picking up his seventh of the season. Adam Brooks had his second. And Matthias Yanmark had his fourth. I'm Brian McCormick. Thanks for sitting in with us this afternoon. Have a happy new year, everyone. We'll talk to you soon. To the airport. Let's fly. Hey, good luck, Brian. Happy new year, guys. Plan is that after the game is over, hopefully within five seconds, I'm in a car already heading out to the airport. It's going to be about a one hour flight, I think. So that should be Whatever I usually do all day leading up to a seven o'clock game, there isn't something else going on. I'm going to try and condense it exactly now. An hour or so. I think we can do it. Marathon day is halfway done. Solid 3-1 win for the Vegas Golden Knights to ring out 2021 and head to the airport now. Uh, to take off, we're gonna go to Ontario. And with any luck, we're gonna get into the Ontario airport about an hour and a half before HSK game time. Flight was delayed a half hour, which actually came in handy, it was a big help. Gives you a moment to just take a breath and think of the afternoon thus far and uh, how much fun it was. And yeah, a lot of hockey today, but uh, nobody's having a very New Year's Eve tonight. Okay, after several significant delays, we have landed in Ontario. It is 10 after six, it's gonna be a photo finish. Run across, get ready for 6.30 pregame and on to game number two. Right circle, Jonas Rombjörg leaves it there for Miramanov. Wrist shot, deflection, score! Miramanov, the wrist shot, it looked like LeCision got a piece in front. And the delayed call, the Silver Knights take a 1-0 lead. And Pouliot found Ben Jones, who slides it between the pads of Garrett Sparks. The Silver Knights have a 3-0 lead. Blake Siebenhaler blew a tire and fell down in front of his own net, lost the puck, and Pavel Dorofiev in all alone, forehand, backhanded, past Sparks. It's a 4-0 Silver Knights lead. Well, if I, if I wasn't doing that, I would have been going home tonight and watching a game on TV anyway, so uh, it's good to keep me actively engaged in it. So again, I'm a lucky guy. That's exactly it. Brian McCormick, voice of the Henderson Silver Knights uh, on the radio.